Judea or Judea, from Hebrew, Yaud Standard Yuda, Tiberian Yuda, Greek, Iudea Iudea, Latin, Iudea, Arabic, Eda Yahudia, is the ancient Hebrew and Israelite biblical, the exonymic Roman, English, and the modern day name of the mountainous southern part of the region of Palestine. The name originates from the Hebrew name, Yehuda, a son of the Jewish patriarch Jacob, Israel, and Yehuda's progeny forming the biblical Israelite tribe of Judah Yehuda and later the associated kingdom of Judah, which the 1906 Jewish Encyclopedia dates from 934 until 586 BCE. The name of the region continued to be incorporated through the Babylonian conquest, Persian, Hellenistic, and Roman periods as Yehud, Yehud Medinata, Hasmonean Judea, and consequently Herodian Judea and Roman Judea, respectively. As a consequence of the Bar Kokhba revolt, in 135 CE the region was renamed and merged with Roman Syria to form Syria Palestina by the victorious Roman Emperor Hadrian. A large part of Judea was included in Jordanian West Bank between 1948 and 1967 i.e., the «West Bank» of the Kingdom of Jordan. The term Judea as a geographical term was revived by the Israeli government in the 20th century as part of the Israeli administrative district named Judea and Samaria area for the territory generally referred to as the West Bank. Etymology <inaudible> 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 The name Judea is a Greek and Roman adaptation of the name, Judah, which originally encompassed the territory of the Israelite tribe of that name and later of the ancient kingdom of Judah. Nimrud Tablet K.3751, dated C.733 BCE, is the earliest known record of the name Judah written in Assyrian cuneiform as Yadaya or Ker, Ia Uda Aa. Judea was sometimes used as the name for the entire region, including parts beyond the River Jordan. In 200 CE Sextus Julius Africanus, cited by Eusebius Church History 1.7.14, described Nazara Nazareth as a village in Judea. Judea was a name used by English speakers for the hilly internal part of Palestine until the Jordanian rule of the area in 1948. For example, the borders of the two states to be established according to the UN's 1947 partition scheme were officially described using the terms Judea and Samaria, and in its reports to the League of Nations Mandatory Committee, as in 1937, the geographical terms employed were Samaria and Judea. Jordan called the area Ad Diffas al Garbia, translated into English as the West Bank. Yehuda is the Hebrew term used for the area in modern Israel since the region was captured and occupied by Israel in 1967. Topic. Historical boundaries The classical Roman Jewish historian Josephus wrote Wars 3 .3 .5, In the limits of Samaria and Judea lies the village Anuath, which is also named Borseos. This is the northern boundary of Judea. The southern parts of Judea, if they be measured lengthways, are bounded by a village adjoining to the confines of Arabia, the Jews that dwell there call it Jordan. However, its breadth is extended from the river Jordan to Joppa. The city Jerusalem is situated in the very middle, on which account some have, with sagacity enough, called that city the navel of the country. Nor indeed is Judea destitute of such delights as come from the sea, since its maritime places extend as far as Ptolemy, it was parted into eleven portions, of which the royal city Jerusalem was the supreme, and presided over all the neighboring country, as the head does over the body. As to the other cities that were inferior to it, they presided over their several toparchies. Gophna was the second of those cities, and next to that Acrobata, after them Thamna, and Lydda, and Emmaus, and Pella, and Idumea, and Engadi, and Herodium, and Jericho, and after them came Jamnia and Joppa, as presiding over the neighboring people, and besides these there was the region of Gamala, and Golanitis, and Batania, and Trachonitis, which are also parts of the kingdom of Agrippa. This last country begins at Mount Libanus, and the fountains of Jordan, and reaches breadthways to the lake of Tiberias, and in length is extended from a village called Arpha, as far as Julius. Its inhabitants are a mixture of Jews and Syrians. And thus have I, with all possible brevity, described the country of Judea, and those that lie round about it. Geography <laughs> <laughs> Judea is a mountainous region, part of which is considered a desert. 
It varies greatly in height, rising to an altitude of 1,020 meters (3,346 feet) in the south at Mount Hebron, 30 kilometers (19 miles) southwest of Jerusalem, and descending to as much as 400 meters (1,312 feet) below sea level in the east of the region. It also varies in rainfall, starting with about 400 to 500 mm (16 to 20 in) in the western hills, rising to 600 mm (24 in) around western Jerusalem in central Judea, falling back to 400 mm (16 in) in eastern Jerusalem and dropping to around 100 mm (3.9 in) in the eastern parts due to a rain shadow effect. This is the Judean Desert. The climate, accordingly, moves between Mediterranean in the west and desert climate in the east, with a strip of steppe climate in the middle. Major urban areas in the region include Jerusalem, Bethlehem, Gush Etzion, Jericho and Hebron. Geographers divide Judea into several regions, the Hebron Hills, the Jerusalem Saddle, the Bethel Hills and the Judean Desert east of Jerusalem, which descends in a series of steps to the Dead Sea. The hills are distinct for their anticline structure. In ancient times the hills were forested, and the Bible records agriculture and sheep farming being practiced in the area. Animals are still grazed today, with shepherds moving them between the low ground to the hilltops as summer approaches, while the slopes are still layered with centuries-old stone terracing. The Jewish revolt against the Romans ended in the devastation of vast areas of the Judean countryside. Mount Hazor marks the geographical boundary between Samaria to its north and Judea to its south. History <inaudible> Early Iron Age The early history of Judah is uncertain. The biblical account states that the Kingdom of Judah, along with the Northern Kingdom, was a successor to a United Kingdom of Israel, but modern scholarship generally holds that the United Monarchy is ahistorical. Regardless, the Northern Kingdom was conquered into the Neo Assyrian Empire in 720 BCE. The Kingdom of Judah remained nominally independent, but paid tribute to the Assyrian Empire from 715 and throughout the first half of the 7th century BCE, regaining its independence as the Assyrian Empire declined after 640 BCE, but after 609 again fell under the sway of imperial rule, this time paying tribute at first to the Egyptians and after 601 BCE to the Neo Babylonian Empire, until 586 BCE, when it was finally conquered by Babylonia. Judea is central to much of the narrative of the Torah, with the patriarchs Abraham, Isaac and Jacob said to have been buried at Hebron in the tomb of the patriarchs. <inaudible> <inaudible> Persian and Hellenistic periods The Babylonian Empire fell to the conquests of Cyrus the Great in 539 BCE. Judea remained under Persian rule until the conquest of Alexander the Great in 332 BCE, eventually falling under the rule of the Hellenistic Seleucid Empire until the revolt of Judas Maccabeus resulted in the Hasmonean dynasty of kings who ruled in Judea for over a century. <laughs> Roman conquest Judea lost its independence to the Romans in the 1st century BCE, by becoming first a tributary kingdom, then a province, of the Roman Empire. The Romans had allied themselves to the Maccabees and interfered again in 63 BCE, at the end of the Third Mithridatic War, when the proconsul Pompeius Magnus Pompey the Great", stayed behind to make the area secure for Rome, including his siege of Jerusalem in 63 BCE. Queen Alexandra Salome had recently died, and a civil war broke out between her sons, Hyrcanus II and Aristobulus II. Pompeius restored Hyrcanus but political rule passed to the Herodian family who ruled as client kings. In 6 CE, Judea came under direct Roman rule as the southern part of the province of Iudea. Although Jews living in the province still maintained some form of independence and could judge offenders by their own laws, including capital offenses, until c. 28 CE. The province of Judea, during the late Hellenistic period and early Roman period was also divided into five conclaves, Jerusalem, Erwom Gadara, Gadur Amethyst, MTW Jericho, Uri and Sepphoris, Zeprin and during the Roman period had eleven administrative districts Toparches, Jerusalem, Gophna, Akrabata, Thamna, Lydda, Amaus, Pella, Adumaea, Engadi, Herodion, and Jericho. Eventually, the Jewish population rose against Roman rule in 66 CE in a revolt that was unsuccessful. 
Jerusalem was besieged in 70 CE and much of the population was killed or enslaved. Bar Kokhba revolt Another 70 years later, the Jewish population revolted under the leadership of Simon Bar Kokhba and established the last kingdom of Israel, which lasted three years, before the Romans managed to conquer the province for good, at a high cost in terms of manpower and expense. After the defeat of Bar Kokhba 132 CE, the Roman Emperor Hadrian was determined to wipe out the identity of Israel Judah Judea, and renamed it Syria Palestina. Until that time the area had been called, "...province of Judea", Roman Judea by the Romans. At the same time, he changed the name of the city of Jerusalem to Elah Capitolina. The Romans killed many Jews and sold many more into slavery. Many Jews departed into the Jewish diaspora, but there was never a complete Jewish abandonment of the area, and Jews have been an important and sometimes persecuted minority in Judea since that time. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Byzantine period. The Byzantines redrew the borders of the land of Palestine. The various Roman provinces Syria Palestina, Samaria, Galilee, and Perea were reorganized into three dioceses of Palestina, reverting to the name first used by Greek historian Herodotus in the mid 5th century BCE Palestina Prima, Secunda, and Tertia or Salutaris, first, second, and third Palestine, part of the diocese of the east. Palestina Prima consisted of Judea, Samaria, the Paralia, and Perea with the governor residing in Caesarea. Palestina Secunda consisted of the Galilee, the lower Jezreel Valley, the regions east of Galilee, and the western part of the former Decapolis with the seat of government at Scythopolis. Palestina Tertia included the Negev, southern Jordan—once part of Arabia—and most of Sinai with Petra as the usual residence of the governor. Palestina Tertia was also known as Palestina Salutaris. According to historian H. H. Ben Sasson, this reorganization took place under Diocletian 284 although other scholars suggest this change occurred later in 390. Timeline 11th century BCE 930 BCE — part of the Kingdom of Israel 930 BCE to 586 BCE — Kingdom of Judah 586 BCE to 539 BCE Babylonian Empire 539 BCE to 332 BCE Persian Empire 332 BCE to 305 BCE Macedonian Empire of Alexander the Great 305 BCE to 198 BCE Ptolemaics 198 BCE to 141 BCE Seleucids 141 BCE to 37 BCE The Hasmonean state in Israel established by the Maccabees after 63 BCE under Roman supremacy 63 BCE Pompey's conquest of Jerusalem 37 BCE to 132 CE Herodian dynasty ruling Judea as vassal kings under Roman supremacy 37 BCE to 4 BCE Herod the Great 4 BCE to 6 CE Herod Archelaus 41 to 44 CE Agrippa I interchanging with direct Roman rule 6 to 41 44 to 132 C 25 BCE Caesarea Maritima is built by Herod the Great 6 CE Census of Quirinius, too late to correspond to census related to Jesus' birth 26–36 Pontius Pilate prefect of Roman Judea during the crucifixion of Jesus 66–73 First Jewish–Roman War, includes destruction of the Second Temple in 70 115–117 Quito's War 132–135 Bar Kokhba's Revolt 135 Emperor Hadrian reverts the name to Syria Palestina first used by Herodotus. Topic See also History of Palestine Iadeos Judea and Samaria area Topic References Topic. 
External links Judea and Civil War The Subjugation of Judea Judea 6–66 CE Judea Photos The Jewish History Resource Center Project of the Dinner Center for Research in Jewish History, Hebrew University of Jerusalem <laughs>